Hey everyone, I'm Rob, and today I'll show you some NBA hang time cheat codes. In one of my previous videos, I showed you guys some cheat codes that can be used at the tonight's matchup screen. And today, I'll show you some cheat codes that can be used in NBA hang time to unlock hidden characters. The previous video I made about NBA Jam cheat codes did very well, and I'm still receiving quite a bit of views. So I figured I'd make another video so that everyone can see these codes and try them themselves. Alright, so with no further ado, let's get started. The first character is Dan Amrich. I did a little research and found out that he was a games journalist in the 1990s when the NBA Jam series was first being developed. To unlock his character, you need to first go into NBA Hangtime, then go to enter your name, type in Amrich. And the code is 2020. And did you hear the announcer said yes? So this is Dan Amrich. So I don't know why they put the bunny ears on him, but um, it's pretty funny. So let's start here. Let's play rooftop. There we go. So, control Dan Amrich. Here we go. Want it? Break away. Oh, look at Dan Amrich. Go, Dan, go. So, they have some special attributes. I'm not sure what they are. Pass it back to me. Uh, they don't tell you, but they're different for each. I don't think his special attribute is. is, uh. Shooting, I think it's stealing. Stealing, probably blocking, maybe dunking. So this is Dan Amrich. Okay, so again, at the enter your name, we're going to um, we're going to put in the code for Dan Rowan. I found out that Dan Rowan was a host of the Chicago Bulls pregame show called The Bullseye, and that's all I really know about him. So let's over here Whoop. enter the name and to unlock Dan Rowan it's Dan R so let's put in let's put in Dan R and you have to hit end and then the code is zero 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 you heard the announcer say yes and there is Dan Rowan with hidden attributes. We'll select him. And again, he has special attributes that we don't really know about. You have to kind of play and use them to figure out what his special attributes are. So this is Dan Rowan who is a uh, talk show host. Back in the 1990s when uh, NBA Jam was being developed. I don't know what he's doing nowadays. But this is Dan Rowan, hidden character in the NBA Hangtime game. Alright, so there he is. Dan Rowan. Let's see if he has an outside shot before we leave. Alright, nice shot, Dan Rowan. Okay, let's go to the next one. Alright, so the next hidden player we'll look at is Larry Munday. I guess Larry Monday was a writer for Playmeter magazine back in the 1990s. Um, so let's take a look at his character. So what we want to do is we want to get into a, you enter your name. We're going to enter Monday. That's M U N D A. Why Monday and the code for Larry Monday is five four three two so that's Larry Monday and there he is he looks like a leprechaun 
Here's a little leprechaun hat on. All right, so let's uh, see what he looks like in game. There he is. He's pretty uh, pretty tall. He's really big. But he loses the tip off. So again, we don't know what the attributes of these players are. There's a bunch of question marks, but I'm sure his is something like blocking, maybe stealing, maybe not. Rebounds. Pass to Larry Monday. Oh. <laughs> so shooting. Shooting isn't one of Larry Monday's strong points. But dunks are. Woohoo. Oh, no, they're not. Maybe they didn't like Larry Monday and they gave him really bad attributes. I don't know. So this is Larry Monday. There he is. Okay, so for the next character, the next hidden character uh, is Mark Turmel. So for those of you who don't know, Mark Turmel was the creator of the NBA Jam franchise, as well as one of the game's developers. And, you know, you can see his name all over the place in the leaderboards on your local system. There he is right here. Turmel. Turmel. So that's Mark Turmel. So let's see here. To unlock his character, go to the enter name screen. You're going to type in Termel with one L. Oh, past the L. And the code for Mark Termel is zero three two two. And there's Mark Termel, hidden attributes. We don't know what they are. Uh, so let's see what he does. Nice long flowing hair. And he's pretty tall, so he's probably gonna have some good shot blocking, oh, which I just did. And probably dunks. So it's probably, again, since cause I'm He's tall, I'm assuming he's gonna have strong... Oh yeah, he's... <laughs> he can block anything, that's great. And assuming since he's the creator of the game that he'll probably be... Oh, I goaltended. He'll probably have the highest attributes out of any of the hidden characters, I'm just assuming. Oh, now he's on fire. Now I can, yeah. You go get him, Mark Tamel. He is on fire. So, uh, I, like I said, I'm assuming that he probably has the best attributes of every hidden character. So there he is, Mark Termel. All right, so let's try the next one. Okay, so the next hidden character is Sal DeVita. Uh, Sal DeVita was one of the NBA Jam franchise designers. I read up on him, and it turns out that he was a voice actor, a video game designer, and a martial artist. Uh, he's mostly famous for his voice acting in the game Mortal Kombat. So, well, actually in the whole series, Mortal Kombat. So that's Sal DeVita. So let's see what his hidden character is all about. So we want to get into a game. Go to where you enter your name. We're going to type in DeVita. D I. And Sal DeVita's code is 0201. 0201. And after you put these in correctly, you're going to have to hear the announcer say, uh, yeah, he says, yeah, or whatever he says. Uh, so there's Sal DeVita. So let's start using Sal, see what he's all about. All right. There he is, another tall one. I think all these guys just made themselves tall. Or maybe they're all tall. I don't know. Goaltending. So again, since he's tall, he's probably good at blocking. But we don't. I don't know what his attributes are. I'd have to play more of these characters 
and then see, I mean, off the start, I could tell that Mark Turmel was good at blocking shots because he blocked a couple <laughs> off the start. And I don't know about this guy. Oh, maybe he's a good three-point shooter. Let's, oh, he hit the first one. Hit the second one. So maybe his, one of his attributes is shooting and stealing. Be weird to have a big tall guy like that be a three-point shooter but hey it's a video game uh, it was close all right so this is Sal get off of me this is Sal DeVita all right let's get to the next one okay for the next hidden character it is Sheridan Ausler uh, Sheridan Osler was a game developer for the NBA Jam series and was involved in development of the Killer Instinct series as well as Mortal Kombat. So he was involved in everything. As I, as I assume a lot of these guys were, I think they all kind of worked together and followed each other and worked on different games together. So let's, um, let's unlock Sheridan Osler's hidden character. So let's go into a game, go to enter name. You're going to put in snow, S-N-O, then go down to the end, hit end, and his code will be 0, 1, 0, 3. And this is Sheridan Osler. Ah, very fancy mustache and a, a, a cop hat. <laughs> Pretty funny with again hidden attributes not sure what the hidden attributes are but we'll find out I want to win this jump ball ah, I won it so he's not that big oh <laughs> so he's not good at dunking maybe he stinks maybe his hidden attributes are that he's no good Maybe they didn't like this guy. I don't know. Maybe they're just playing a joke on him. Let's see here. Ah, he hit a three-pointer. So that's good. Trying to steal the ball. See if he's good at stealing or blocking. Uh, I don't know. Again, you're going to have to try out these characters to see. Ah, he's good at shooting. Let's see if he's good at stealing. Nope. He's good at goaltending. So this is um, Sheridan Ausler. Yeah, he's good at shooting. So I'm, I'm sure he's. Oh, yep, stole it. So seems like um, shooting and stealing are his attributes. Definitely not dunks. Definitely not blocking. All right, so that's Sheridan Ausler. All right, so the next hidden character we're going to unlock is John Hay. Uh, from what I can tell, John Hay was the lead sound and music programmer for the NBA Hangtime and NBA Jam franchise. That's all I could really find out about him. Uh, let's get into the game. Go to enter name. And to unlock John Hay, you're going to put in John Hay. That's J O. Go past it. N H E Y. And John Hayes code is 6000. I want to turn up the volume because I want you to hear what it says. It says, hey. So everyone else, it says yes, but on John Hayes, um, little confirmation, it says, hey, just a little Easter egg there. All right, so let's see what John Hay is all about. So John Hay, maybe not a shooter. Stop and pop. Oh, he's good at stealing. He's pretty good shooting. So he's a shooting guard. Yep, 
Maybe he's quick. Oh, don't leave John Hay alone. Come on, son. You never leave John Hay alone outside, big guy. Go down, come back around. Oh, he's all alone. And he's hurting you. Oh, so you got revenge on him by pushing him back. Oh, John Hay can't rebound well. Come on, big guy. Come on, big guy. Stop and pop. Oh, you don't leave John Hay alone outside. Look at this. It's a blood... Who pushes him again? It's a bloodbath. Oh, look at that. John Hay. Oh, don't leave John Hay alone. Yeah, so, so he's a shooter. So I think that's all the hidden characters that we have. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you can, please subscribe. And as always, if you want to chat, leave me a comment. Thanks for watching, and have a good day.